To the latest on coronavirus in Arizona. Yesterday, the State Department of Health reported almost 2,000 new cases and nearly 200 new deaths. But Arizona did hit a major milestone in fighting the virus. Governor Ducey announcing 1 million doses of the vaccine have now been given out. High demand and technology barriers have made it tough at times for some of our state's most vulnerable people to get an appointment for the COVID-19 vaccine. But one local health group is helping break down those barriers, making sure seniors who want a shot can get one. Team 12's Jen Wall joins us live from the Granite Reef Senior Center in Scottsdale. So Jen, what are they doing differently there? Yeah, good morning, Rachel. The push to get seniors vaccinated in Arizona is taking another step forward. Honor Health partnering with the Granite Reef Senior Center to vaccinate a small group of senior citizens. This is important because not everyone, especially some in our elderly population, can get to an appointment even though they're in the priority group. Now, some cannot drive the long distances to get to an appointment by themselves or they just don't have the ability to make one online. So Honor Health says they identified a group of seniors to vaccinate through a program that helps them with food, medical care and safety problems. Honor Health adds giving 63 doses at the center yesterday was a very calculated number. Interestingly enough, the Pfizer doses come in, do in vials of seven, so we needed to work in, bu in bunches of seven and 63 was that magic number for us today. Again, to make sure that no doses go wasted and that we're using every drop of that precious vaccine. State data reveals the big push to vaccinate people 65 and older. They equal nearly half of all vaccinated Arizonans and are almost double the other age groups. But remember, they're a priority group, so they are among the select groups of people that can sign up right now, whereas others still can't based on age alone. They have to meet other qualifications like being in medicine, law enforcement, teachers or others. And the vaccine rollout is speeding up in southern Arizona too. Another state run site is expected to open up at the University of Arizona next week. Now it's also expected to be a 24 hour operation like State Farm Stadium, but we're told that's going to take just a little bit because of that limited vaccine supply. So stay with 12 News for updates there. For now live in Scottsdale, Jen Wall. All today in AZ.